friends, welcome to my regular Sunday shoebox unboxing here on B Swain's Shoebox Sundays. So today I have an unboxing for you of a box that I packed for Operation Christmas Child for a boy in the age range of 10 to 14. It has a quite common theme. It's a soccer theme, but it has a little bit of a twist because there's something in here that I created that I really love. And also, I thought this would be a good box for this young man to have items to be a soccer player or a soccer coach or a soccer referee. So let me show you what I packed. I used a regular uh, shoe box. It's larger than an OCC Go box. I added some decorative duct tape. I added the sticker. I packed a shoe box. I have lots of those stickers and I thought it would kind of cute here on top. And then there's just a sticker here so that I know that this is a soccer themed shoebox. On the inside of the lid, I used some more of the duct tape just straight across the box. I added the phrase, Jesus loves you, and a couple of soccer stickers. These are really great stickers, nice quality. I ordered those from nair.org, N-A-E-I-R.org. They're like self-adhesive ephemera pieces so they're really good quality okay so this is what he'll see when he looks inside his box right on top i have this really cool puzzle i have a couple of these puzzles i gave a couple of them away as gifts but i kept a couple for my shoe boxes they're really great quality because they're like wooden pieces and all the pieces are shaped like different animals. So there's a lion, kangaroo. I think it's a stingray. Not positive on that one. But anyway, they're all different shapes of animals. Here is a giraffe. And this is the image that the puzzle creates. It's a really fun, colorful giraffe. Very whimsical, I love this. I'm not sure how many pieces this is. I'm thinking maybe a hundred. I think it'll be a lot of fun for this young man to have something fun to do when he's not playing soccer. Okay, so he has a pair of long, like athletic style socks, which he will need for soccer. He has a soccer shirt. It's, it's a from Old Navy. It says life goals on there, but it has a soccer in a soccer net. It is a size extra large, 1416. I think I got it on clearance. I'm pretty sure I did. Here he has a pump for his soccer ball. And I see I only have one needle in here. I need to add another needle so he has a spare. He has this really fun, squishy light up creature. He has a necklace. It's a cross and I strung on this cord and added some beads. He has a whistle. This is a great whistle because it has a thermometer on this side and a compass on this side. But he has a nice whistle, a nice quality whistle. So if he ends up being a soccer referee, he has his whistle. he will need that. So here's his soccer ball. It's an Umbro brand. He'll have fun playing, organizing his teams. He has a pair of underwear, which is a size extra large. Children's extra large. A toothbrush with a cap. Here's his shorts to go along with his shirt. So he has a nice outfit. These are just gray shorts, Sonoma brand. So he has his underwear, shorts, shirt, and socks. He's set to play soccer. Here is a bandana that looks like a referees a shirt right well actually i don't know do referees in soccer wear black and white striped i mean they do in american football i'm not sure about soccer but anyway he can have this and it will be a good piece of apparel to designate that he is the soccer referee a hygiene packet here that has a teenage mutant ninja turtles themed Magic towel for his washcloth. He has this nice little mending kit here that has needles and thread and buttons and safety pins. He has band-aids, a lip balm, and he has 
a bar of soap, OCC is going to phase out sending soap. So I will not be purchasing any more soap for my shoe boxes, that is. A small box of crayons, a fidget spinner. He has this magnetic checkers travel game. I got a bunch of these in a multi-pack on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description. He has a small comb, a larger comb. Here is a note and photo, family photo, that I've included for the child. I just put a uh, a sticker on the top of this note card and the note and photo is inside. A collapsible water bottle, which is a Toy Story themed. There we go. He has three strands of beads. I have a bunch of these black, gold, and silver beads because I got these. I think we were having a New Year's Eve party years and years ago and we ordered these in bulk and we there were some that packaging hadn't even been opened and so I have a bunch of these to pack in my shoe boxes. He has this silicone wrist bracelet that I got after St. Patrick's Day and it says lucky and blessed. He has this notebook that I created. This is not his notebook for, for school. This is his notebook in case he wants to be a soccer coach. He can keep his team notes in this book. It is a journal size. And so I use my book binding tool to punch the holes in the paper and the cover, and the back cover, and then added the spiral binding. And I put some stickers on the cover. And then on the inside cover, and then the back cover, on the inside of the back cover, I added some pockets. And in the front pocket, he's got some more soccer-themed stickers. He has a whole bunch of them. He has just some little note cards, just so he can take these out and write in them and then maybe give them to his players or the opposite team or... Uh, like if he needs to write a note to a player or however he'd like to use these little black and white note cards. And then I have this packaging. This pen came on this packaging. I got this after Christmas on clearance at Hobby Lobby. And I wanted to include it because it explains what this is. It's a pen that has a level. It has a level. Levels are okay to send even though they have that tiny little bit of liquid in them. Operation Christmas Child has said that a level is okay to send and this is teeny tiny. Then he has, uh, it has a, like a, a ruler on it that has inches and centimeters and it's got centimeters and then this end of this, this end um, unscrews and then there is two screwdriver heads, a Phillips and a flathead and I put the pen inside the binding. But back to the notebook, I just have blank white paper that I've added to the spiral. And then in the back pocket, I tucked in some loose leaf paper and there are some stickers decorating the pocket. This one actually shows that it's like a strategy uh, board on a clipboard. So maybe he'll get the idea that he can use the paper to keep track of his plays. There's just a whistle. I had some really cute scrapbook paper that had soccer balls on it. And so that's what I used to decorate the cover. And this was really fun to do. And he has a tote bag. This was a tote bag I got on clearance at Walmart a while back. It has the teams that were in the 2022 World Cup. So maybe he'll find his country on there. You never know. It's got all the different countries that were in the World Cup. He has this really nice school pack. I got these pencil pouches on clearance at Walmart a few years ago. I think I got this a couple years ago. But anyway, it has a Velcro closure and then it unfolds like that. And it has different compartments. There's something else really great in there. Oh, calculator, little mini calculator, some scissors, and then in this zipped pouch, I have a nice large pencil sharpener 
some pens, a glue stick, some regular number two lead pencils, a mechanical pencil, some colored pencils. He has these holders here for some of his fun pencils, his soccer themed pencils, green and black, and then just some black and white checked pencils. And then in this compartment over here, he has little little pencil sharpeners, a jumbo eraser, some pencil cap erasers, a ruler. So he's got all the bases covered for his school supplies. And this just rolls back up like this. Fasten it shut with a Velcro. It's his school pack. And then he has a fun activity book. I've shown these before because I got a bunch of these on clearance at Walmart. And it's a Wakanda Forever coloring and activity book. I especially love these for 10 to 14 boys because the images are a little bit more intricate like an adult coloring book. It comes with this really nice quality poster which you can remove and hang up. And then it has some stickers. So he has a folder and then I didn't put his paper inside the folder because it made it hard to pack and the paper doesn't stay very well when you like try to pack this in the box but when he um unpacks it he can put his paper for school inside his folder and put this right in his backpack and then he'll be set for school i love this folder i believe i got it at dollar tree and it has sports balls on it, including soccer balls, and it says go team. Oh, that's it. That's what I have packed in this box for this young man. And I thank you for watching. I, I love showing my 10 to 14 boy boxes, and I'd love for you to um, like this video. If you saw something you liked, leave me a comment and share your ideas and your thoughts, and maybe tell me what your packing and if you pack soccer balls what you include with your soccer balls and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so I'll see you again probably next Sunday thanks thanks friends and bye for now